Strangers judging each other, they go hand in hand. Yes, so I've noticed that my last react video did really well. Look at the numbers, insane, so good. And so we've decided we're gonna do another one. When I say we, it's just me, so uh, yeah. But before we begin, 30% of you watching have not subscribed, so if you could just click it, I've made it so easy for you, just, okay. People have been saying good things about this video, so I expect a good video. I wasn't planning to go to college. That wasn't like a goal of mine. My parents were like, well, you should apply to at least one college. And I was like, I'll never get in here. And then I went to Yale. Okay. We brought six people together to rank themselves based on perceived intelligence. I don't even need the whole text. I can say it. My IQ is high. Why are you laughing? What was funny? I want to know. I like a good laugh. What's up with this one's outfit? It's, uh, it's, it's something. All right, let's still also take an IQ test. All right, I'm feeling it. Should we just like go down and do intros? Yeah, I'm Shade. I'm 24. I work in finance. I have a bachelor's degree. What was, what was her name when it showed up? Yeah, I'm Shade. I'm 24. I Shade. work in finance. I have a bachelor's degree. I uh, went to Yale. I'm Tyler. I'm 21. All I'm right. a high school graduate, and I work in the Marine Corps. I'm an army man. High IQ. So her name was Shade, I believe. Went to Yale. Marine didn't didn't go to didn't go to university or college. I don't think so. All right. I'm Kaylee. Um, I'm 25. I'm a software developer. I went to Ohio University and I have a bachelor's degree. Maria, I'm right. 30 years old. All right. I have my PhD in cancer biology. Big brain. And I work in a biotech industry. Big brain. In grad school, I went to University of South Carolina and undergrad, I went to University of Florida. Huge, massive, put the filter. This is what she is. A PhD <laughs> in, in, in biology. I don't even know what the, the full form of PhD is. I'm kidding. It's a... Pretty huge degree. Yeah. Hi everybody, my name is Sean. I'm 27. I'm the director of social media for a company and I also work for a digital ad agency. I got a double major in dance and cultural anthropology. Undergrad, I went to the Loyola Marymount University. Hi everybody. All right. Sean's, uh, Sean's also got that two degree situation going on for him. How? And he's, you know, he's moving mad. Bottom line, Sean's moving, Matt. Hey, I'm 24. I graduated with a bachelor's degree in Harvard recently, and I work in consulting. Oh, no. Hold the phone. My guy went to Harvard. What? He's not stupid. I don't think so. We need a. Maybe it's good to identify what intelligence means to everybody. I think intelligence is better defined as your adaptability and your problem-solving skills. Such an army, lad. Uh, 100%. More than it is your education. Obviously, like the education, the stuff you've been through, puts a lot into playing it because it gives you more resources, more thoughts to draw from. The formal education definitely helps, but I don't think it's in any way essential. So yes. Yes. You tell him, Tyler. Education is is a hoax. Cancel. Drop out. Leave. Don't give them your money. Take that money and do something else with it. Make YouTube videos like me and hope that one day you get to the big number. 75 subscribers. Come on guys, we're so close. Please, god damn it. Most essential. I'd say the most essential thing was to probably be common sense. Yeah, so for me. Yes, Tyler knows what's up. His IQ is not low. Boom, I don't know why I had to take so many pauses, but I did. Personally, I think intelligence is both EQ, IQ, and that common sense, street smart intelligence, all of that combined. People. Exactly. She gave a small, short, 
precise answer. What does this mean? What does this tell us as human beings? It tells us nothing. <laughs> no, okay, it tells us, okay, it's, 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 yeah, good. Consciously or unconsciously, when they see someone, form an opinion immediately. Like, I'm sure we all did right away. When I saw you... I that's, that's her explanation? That's what intelligence means to her? That we ask you for a definition and that's what you give us? Kylie, Ki wait, what's her name? Kylie? Kaylee. <laughs> Not Kylie. But uh, yeah, no, you're on the low end. I'm sorry. Oh, you. I told myself, Maria, do not judge him just yeah. by his looks. He could be throwing you off, or that's just who he is. But he can talk the talk and walk the walk. Sean? She judged Sean. Maria has done an oopsie. She has judged Sean. I mean, but then she said she, she told herself not to judge Sean. So she didn't judge Sean. She judged, but then she didn't judge. Cancelled. Out. Like, like a cancelled out, not cancelling her. Goddamn cancelled culture. First impressions, I would put him at the bottom only because when I was in school, all the other people with like the bright neon colors and stuff, they were typically the ones doing worse in classes. If we were ranked... <laughs> if I had to put him straight up, he goes at the bottom. Like, what are you wearing? Huh? What are those funky ass colors? No! No. <laughs> If we were ranking confidence, I'd definitely put Sean at very right, first place. Sean's got confidence. What is the definition that we're going with is the biggest question. I like your definition. I know, I was going to say, I like my definition. <laughs> yeah. It combines everything. I feel like I have a good combination of both, like book smart and street smart. So yeah, I think I have some input on that. There's... I've got the book smart, I've got the street smart, so, so yeah. It really goes beyond IQ and EQ. Even those two different factors really don't really capture what it really means to be intelligent. Yes. I know I'm not. Yes. You tell him. I forgot your name already, but you tell him. My whole life, I've kind of had to fight to be seen as intelligent. I think I'm so used to having to do that as a woman to just like step up and be like, yep, I deserve to be here. My first job. She's using sexism to get ahead of the race. No. I mean, like, no, sexism is a thing, but like. I was working on a law firm. Gentleman came up to me and said, Hi, um, you don't look like somebody that would work at a law firm. You look like somebody I'd go on spring break with. And I'm like, what? I'm like, Obviously. I and yeah, whoever's done that, whoever's asked her that question, or whoever said that. What are you doing? What are you doing? Just, we, you are what's wrong. You. No. That. Cancelled. You're cancelled. Somewhere, you're somewhere out there and you're getting cancelled. I just know it. I can see it. Out of everyone here, I've got the least formal education. I consider myself intelligent. My mental dedication and my ability to adapt and to problem solve. What I do in the Marine Corps, I'm a seabird defense specialist. So I think that by virtue of what I do, that already requires some amount of intelligence. Sorry, quick question. So do you think that only certain people can do your job or do you think anyone can do your job? Only certain people. Uh, Damn straight. What you think anyone could just walk in and be a marine? <laughs> please, please, that's 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 all right. Just uh, what are you saying? You have to take the ASVAB before you go into the military. That's uh, not really how much you know, but how well you can learn information. And I got a 94 on that. It's not an amount of how much you study, how much you know. You're not going to really get better at learning. Does that make sense? I strongly disagree with you. Don't get better at learning. The idea that you can get better at learning is a pretty big thing. <laughs> you see his face. Well, she went last Australia too. He's just like. I'm very much dyslexic. I have ADHD and I'm on the autism spectrum. Dyslexia means that there's a big gap in comprehension. So I was scoring 99th percentile in certain areas and like third percentile in others. I'll never be able to learn. Because you suck at the others and you're good at the others. <laughs> no, let's, 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 let's not just. No. Cats, I didn't say that. I took Spanish for. 12 years and I can still basically only order a burrito. So I have a question. Absolute idiots. I took French for four years and I can have a conversation with the French president if I had to. So yeah, uh, yeah, hit me up. Yeah, you know where to find me. The OG mustache, first, pl 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 just get me to 75 subscribers and then I'll talk. Why did you go to Yale and why did you go to Harvard? My oh shit. Immigrants from China. I'm a first generation immigrant as well and college student as well. My family always really stressed the importance of formal education. For me, that was something that I really strive for. It pretty much he said, what he said is, uh, I have Chinese parents 
they stressed education is important and so I was slapped silly into going to Harvard University. But to cover it up, he's like, but you know what? I also really like, I, I like, I like, I like, uh, you know, studying. I mean, he probably does that. I wasn't planning to go to college. I didn't, that wasn't like a goal of mine. My parents were like, well, you should apply to at least one college. And I was like, I'll never get in here. And then I went to Yale. So she didn't think she was getting into it. Uh, she didn't apply, she didn't want to go to college, but she, and she went to Yale. Low IQ. She's at the bottom for me. She goes right there. Above her is, is, is Kaylee. Why don't you guys rank each other from one to six, including yourself, and give reasons why you want to do what you're doing? I gotta go one. No. Oh yeah. Two, three, four, five, six. Bro, madness. All right, so she's put him up top. I respect that. I get that. She's put him her second. Sorry, my bad. She's put herself third, which I would not. I will. That isn't. Hmm. She goes sixth in my position. In, in my opinion, she's put her fourth, him fifth. <laughs> okay. Sh I don't even know how to pronounce your name at this point, but like, yeah, you, okay. Well, I see. I see you. I would rank you as a six, not meaning that you're not intelligent. I also think that I don't. That is what it means. That you're the least intelligent from six people. You're stupid. That's what she's told him. She's literally told Tyler, Tyler, listen. Hello, hi, how are you? You're stupid. And Tyler's just there like. I'd probably do one, two, three, four, Five, six. I'm sorry. I'm the villain this episode. <laughs> How does he put her first? Put yourself first or put put this one. I don't remember I don't know her name. I forgot her name. Put her second put her first. But not her. She goes last. Put her last. Someone please put her last. Does anyone think they're like either end of the spectrum? I'd say I'm one, if nothing else, because I know what I'm about and I'm sure of that. Damn, Tyler. Damn, he's moving mad. Confidence and all that. Confidence is key. That is true. That is good. Good, good on you, Tyler. I respect that. I would say one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. <laughs> he was so quick. It was so quick to put Sean last. Sean, you just, nah. For, like, I thought he put her last because she put him last, but like, he's not about that game because he's an army man, goddammit. Respects people. He's a good, good lad. Good, good man. I think one. Okay. Two. Okay. Three, okay. four, five, six. Alright, alright. I was, you know what? I like I like her game and I like I like his game. I've got his name again. Uh, you know, because they're they they're not putting themselves up front. They they think and I think that is absolutely stupid. Put yourself up. Like you're, if you're smart, you're smart. I'm smart. If I'd be in that room, I'd be like one and six. Every single one of you, six, 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 one. Deal with it. I immediately get kicked out of the show. But you know, it's, it, it's about confidence. God damn it, Tyler! It's confidence. Going to college, I think you learn a lot, if nothing else, emotionally. Bullshit! I called it. Education is a hoax. <laughs> I mean, it works. It works. Some people work. Some people doesn't. It depends. Whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, immigrant parents, first generation going yeah. to college, humble, okay. modest. Two, me, I don't know, PhD, <laughs> cancer <laughs> biology <laughs> scientist, I work in a biotech company, we make- Fair enough, I put, put yeah. Stuff oh, like that. Oh. And then six. Tyler, he ranked last for me personally because the way he carries himself, he was ranking intelligence based on his point of view and not taking in other people's point of views and compiling results, but really just came down to his body language, his demeanor, the way he carried himself, the way he acted towards the group. I Look at this, technical answer. So good. Bellissimo. I would put one, okay. two, All right. okay. three, okay. four, oh, five, and now six. So the reason why I put you oh. at number one is I think you have the highest, not only EQ score out of everybody, but the way you present yourself, as well as being a PhD student, I think is just like a huge thing. And I put myself six because I feel like I might be the 
weakest in terms of actual IQ score. Hopefully I can make it up and everything else. So I did put- What an absolute mad lad. So honest, so colorful. <laughs> myself as least intelligent. However, if it can't be me, I definitely think Tyler, unfortunately. Because everyone disrespecting Tyler. God damn it, Tyler. Just, he's an army man. God damn it. He's fighting for your country or that country if you're not from that country. Not the most number yeah. ones. Thank you. Look down. Who got the most? Sean A was pretty up there too. Tyler, you know where you're going, Tyler. Right, right? Tyler, you know where you're going, Tyler. Tyler, go. Is anyone upset with where they're standing? I think it makes sense that I'm down here. Like the guy who graduated from high school and then joined the military, he probably wouldn't be like high up on there. If I was in their shoes, I definitely would have also ranked myself among the lowest. Everything he says is so straight. Like he's so like direct and like, he's like, like mm, boom, information given. There's no, you know, he doesn't go around. So he just goes, he doesn't beat around the bush. He goes straight to it. He's a man, I, I, I respect him, I respect him. Oh, okay. But where's it? Oh, he's taking out his phone. Look at him. He doesn't need a laptop. So number one is Raymond. Number two would be Kaylee. Number three will be Tyler. And number Let's four go. would be Shada. Number five is Sean. And number six is Maria. Damn. Ha! Oh, shit. She got a lot. <laughs> I did not see that coming. I, I mean, I saw him going high. I, I saw Tyler moving up. I saw Shada moving lower, but I didn't see her going there. I put her like second. Damn. Jeez. Sean's not moved. Sean's not moved at all. Sean stayed exactly where he was. Before this, all I knew about IQ tests is that they existed. And the I stands for intelligence. I've never looked into IQ tests before. Coming here today. You think he doesn't even know what Q stands for. Oh, cool. that's what it stands for. I, we're gonna, when I'm gonna put that in, I obviously knew that. We're gonna be like, ha, let's go back to me saying he doesn't even know what Q stands for. Coming back to intelligence, it's not just your IQ, it's your EQ, it's your common sense, it's street smarts. Sure, it is some type of metric, similar to an SAT and ACT score is a metric for getting into college, but there's more to that person than that test. Maria! You've been slapped by the IQ test. You went from second all the way to sixth. That's like four jumps to the last position. Yeah. She doesn't look she doesn't look too amused with the test. She's like, hmm. I wouldn't be either. I think an IQ test is a good indicator to see how people handle pressure, but I think that's easier to make sense in our heads that, oh, you're smart and you're not smart. Sean is smart. That's it. That's, that's, that's my conclusion to Sean. This is my villain redemption arc and climbing <laughs> up the ladder. <laughs> Hell yeah, you see Tyler, absolutely insane Tyler. So good, so good. I knew Tyler was smart. I knew eventually he'd go up. I did not see uh, Maria going all the way down. See, I remember the names now. Uh, and the first guy, I, I don't know what his name is. But that is it for this one. You know what, Jubilee, like hit me up, put me on a, on a, on a video and just watch me annihilate everyone. That is it for this one. But before I end it, before I do the, you know, things, subscribe, just <clears throat> share the video with your grandma. I'm sure she loves me. Who wouldn't? I would. Uh, but yeah, that is it for this one. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.